uh, Victoria Canadian gymnast. Um, Rose Canadian national gymnast. Well, it's not in the family, so my dad and mommy saw a newspaper article when I was maybe three or two and a half or three, and then they asked me if I wanted to do gymnastics, and I said, well, yes. So I tried gymnastics, and I just loved it from there. Well, I just wanted to follow her steps and be like her, so she was kind of like a model for me. Rose looked at uh, her sister doing gymnastics because she was very small. I think Victoria started at three and Rose, she's like one year old, and she said, oh, I want to do like Yaya. Yeah, yeah. The father did uh, Taekwondo. He was black belt Taekwondo. Me, I did ballet, but not just like, uh, not seriously like uh, the kids. Je suis Charlon, head coach of uh, de Michelieu. Okay, I'm uh, first. I'm a phys ed uh, teacher, and uh, from '76 I began to coach uh, when I was very young, the men. And after six years, I change uh, and and make the de Michelieu club for girl. And I have my level four and. Uh, many experience. They are both uh, very, very uh, good worker and they are very different. Uh, Victoria, she's the older girl. She's uh, the one that she learned a little bit uh, lower, but uh, she's very determined and uh, she begin very slowly and go up uh, after many years with objective and we are very proud about, about Victoria. Rose, uh, right away, she had a very soon success because her uh, physical was more right away uh, prepared for doing gymnastics. And Rose, uh, she have some other thing that different than Victoria about uh, the way we must work with her. But she's very, very determi determination about to be the best that she can do. And her head is very, very strong. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, she has a big character. She's, she's not the girl that's gonna show her emotions really. Like when she's injured or she's hurting somewhere. I know she's hurt, but she won't show it. But. She's a bit shy at first, but she's not shy anymore. <laughs> um, she's a fun person, a social person, and um, she likes to laugh around and do girly. We do we girly love things. we love do girly stuff together. Yeah. Like I don't know, um, shopping. Shop or going at the Sephora. Oh, we could stay there for hours. <laughs> I think when I was pre-novice at the um, Eastern Championships, like we went, we went away for like four days and without my mom and my parents. So that was kind of like exciting for me. And that was a good memory. Oh yes, I do have a memory. We went to this competition in um, Orlando, Florida. Um, I think it was called the Orlando Classic or something like that. And we had so much fun because it was on the Walt Disney site and we went on the roller coasters the night before but then ended up competing really early in the morning. <laughs> so it wasn't a great idea. I think I felt like I fell like four times on, on being in. Yeah. My philosophy is to prepare the girl very hard in the gym and to have fun in competition. And the most interesting most of the time when the competition is going well is the competition because the preparation, the work on gym is ju just prepare, prepare, and to be ready that they don't really need me and I try to enjoy to look her working good. <laughs> I think um, uh, the national coach in this, that time um, opened the door that that some gymnasts come and and be new in the in the system, 
but have great potential, give more chance for more club and and try to decentralize in a way the system use what if a gym and gymnast come from another club that she's not known to have success but she, they have great potential and she take all this potential together and and with we have a, a good success about it. We prepare Vitalia to be very stable and to be uh, to show Canada that she can contribute uh, to the team. Uh, the way that Dave Brubaker used her it was like to start the competition everywhere, and this is a very difficult position. But the way she trained in the in the training camp, she pushed the national coach to use her. And, and Vitalia told me it was funny because Vitalia, when she said to me, you know what, I like to, f to fight, to be on team, and to have, in the beginning, it's not easy, but I like it. More is the stress is tough, more is good for me. And for the first championship, she was like, um, supposed to do a three event, maybe two, and the end she finished four. Uh, the second championship, uh, her position more, was more like a substitute and the way she worked close close to the she improved and more show stability and she finished that she do for her parade. Victoria when, when she was uh, in list for the first cha world championship we were even not sure that she would do it and and she said you know what I like being mad and it, we, I said okay let's go if you do well we buy you one, and we buy her one, and second world, we buy her a second one, big man. <laughs> when I was going through puberty, um, I was injured a lot. And my hip was hurting, my elbow was hurting, and then most recently my ankle, which is still bothering me, but I could still work on it. I just have to tape it every day. Um, actually this summer I got a severe injury in my back so I couldn't train or run or do anything for about three months and that was kind of like a hard patch for me because before I was never injured well you know little injuries but not as bad as this one so now it still hurts but I'm dealing with it. Rose have a big, uh, she never had injury until um, last year. She have a discal hernia and she get paralyzed on her legs and it was like 14 weeks to stop. Um, it's scary, she cannot move her feet and you know, you say, ooh, that's big, you know. I got really scared about it. Oh my God, she's doing uh, physio like every week. She's doing like four times per week. She have a coach uh, on Pilates and she see her doctor uh, like one time a month to see everything, it's okay. One thing I love about gymnastics is the feeling you get when you land a, a good, good routine. routine. It's just like, it's amazing. You feel it in your heart. Yeah. <laughs> Um, originally my goal was to go at the World Championships, Olympics was way back in my head but I mean moving forwards and seeing that we are both high level gymnasts, um, I think we just work for the Olympics now.